Dog abuse makes the headlines more often than we think. Pets are subject to abuse from owners daily and many do not recover from it. But what happens to the lucky ones who do? Ida Jimenez has been a dog owner and a pure breed lover her entire life. It wasn't until she lost her great Dane Goliath to cancer that her dog trainer played a huge role into bringing a very special family member into her new home. He said there are wonderful dogs that come from adoption and he touched my heart with that phrase. Before arriving at Ida's house, this dog had stopped at different destinations and escaped death, as the foster mom explained to her. When she received a phone call from a shelter facility that she works with, you know, very good, and uh, the, the person from the office said, hey, you should come to pick up a dog. He has something special and he has been put on a list to be euthanized. He's been forever in the shelter and nobody wanted him. Unfortunately, not all dogs get as lucky as Dono did, as a rescuer recounts. Miami Dade does put the dogs to sleep and they do not care if it's been there for two weeks or a day or three, they will put the dog down if they need to. A dog expert shares his opinion on dog abuse and the system. Laws are just not strong enough for that, but I think if we had laws that were stronger, uh, you'd see a, a huge decline in animal abuse. But how can people help animals that are possibly part of an abusive environment? Get it on video. And try to get facial features. If you see them going into a car, try to get the tag. Dono's mom always gives a piece of advice. Give it a chance to that dog that is not so easy going or outgoing when you are passing by all those places because there is a wonderful, wonderful dog that is hidden in a shell.